Hello everyone, I'm Mikko and I love gaming, and this is Sonic 4, episode 1. Hopefully the music is not going to be too loud this time, I'm trying to uh, find the right balance between recordings with my new mic. Uh, I actually have not played this game yet. Uh, I remember when it came out, everybody was just freaking shitting on it, and I was like, okay, well, maybe I'll just wait it out a bit and get it when I can get it for a less, and... Finally came up on a sale on Steam, so I decided, okay, now was as good a time as any. New game. Oh, and he just drops him right into it. Okay. Adventure begins as soon as it's done loading, I guess. Okay, that does look a little bit awkward, the 3D lighting thing. It probably looks worse on my computer for whatever reason. Okay, whatever. Yeah, uh, I was a big fan of Sonic back in the day. Like, I think he has his homing attack thing that he got in later games. Like, uh, I was a fan of Sonic, like, literally when the very first game came out. I'm that old. <laughs> I remember the uh, Sega Mega Drive ads, because that's what they called it over here. Uh, where it was all like, ah, so everything's so fast and so awesome, and Sonic was, of course, their showcase game. <sighs> Fucking beat. But, uh... Never actually owned a Mega Drive myself. I played the first couple of games at friend's place, and, uh... And number three, and, uh, Sonic and Knuckles. I rented out, actually. I did, did jump on, okay. I rented them out a couple weekends. I got the, uh... Went to the local, uh, video retailer. Uh, no, video rental store, and, uh... Instead of getting some films, we decided to get me uh, same Mega Drive for the weekend, and I played the crap out of it for uh, however long we had it. Okay, I do have the homing attack. Eh, it's kind of lame, but super speed. Searing point. Okay, actually, there was a secret in there. Uh, totally wasting the super speed. Ah no! Tricky. That can remind me of the first games, definitely. Oh, I got 100, 100 uh, rings. That probably uh, does something good for me. It's been a long freaking while. Oh, oh god, my fucking coins! You chameleon bastard! But yeah, I really played Sonic back in the day, but when he, when the games went 3D, I just kind of... Okay, well, that, that went really well. <laughs> Yeah, when the games went 3D, I just sort of lost interest in them. Not, not necessarily even so much... Oh my god, I, I slowed down very easily. It wasn't necessarily like 100% the game's fault, just like me not feeling like that kind of games at the time, but... Wow, I'm really uh, having to rely on the... Uh, I need to speed up. But uh, as you may have noticed, uh, watching my videos, I do have a certain ah uh, craving for nostalgia. So, it really seemed like a like a good idea to give the game at least a try, even though people were hating on it. And so far, it doesn't feel bad. Not not the biggest fan of the visual style, but again, that might just be a, because of my graphic card or whatever that it looks like what it does. There we go, 100 coins again. They just feel longer than the old ones, at least by a little bit. Up! Oh. Get in the giant ring. Nope! Oh my god, how did I not get in the giant ring in the jump? Guess I missed out on a bonus stage there. Good work, me. Also, why is Y button the play the next act? Okay. Not gonna get a great score at this anyway, because. <laughs> It's been a while since I played a Sonic game. I have two and three on my 360, but it's been a little while since I played them. Ah, those chameleons are tricky. Okay, uh, what? I guess there's gonna be a spring somewhere? Or, uh, oh, it didn't get me long to get caught up. Okie dokie. Is that enough to fling me up there? Okay. It didn't look like it would be enough, but. 
Oink. Eh, <laughs> nose. Yeah, the game. Whoa. <laughs> the game feels fairly original, Sonic -y. Like I said, the I'm not, not a big fan of the homing jump thing. Cause kind of feels cheap, but probably just trust that they uh, took it into account while designing. Ah. Get up there! There we go. It has a lot of the usual stuff. The enemies popping up out of nowhere, annoying the crap out of me. <laughs> the alternative routes. Fast stuff, the looping. Maybe the problem is they didn't innovate enough for something? I can't recall exactly what people were saying. Like, I just remember that a lot of, a lot of them seemed unhappy with the game. Huh, what did I miss there? Probably something really important, like an extra life or something. Oh god, that's not what I meant to do at all. I meant to... There we go. Get the extra speedy shoes. Yeah, not gonna miss them all. Not sure if it's just me or do the slowdowns feel a little bit more annoying than they used to back in the day, but... Maybe I'm just all impatient now. I did make it higher up. Oh god, I damaged it again. There we go. <laughs> ah, I guess now we'll see if there's some kind of bonus stage for uh, getting in the ring. I recall that being the entire point of getting, getting the 100 rings, but... So, maybe this is the big disappointment? Oh, that's kind of taunting for people who really don't like the visual style. Okay, I gotta rotate the screen? Huh, okay. That feels a lot... Okay, what am I missing here? Like, hmm. This feels a whole lot easier than the... Than the, uh... Old way of it just rotating on its own and you just having to jump through it. Oh, I guess it's the one where the, uh... Blocks break. If I hit him. Does this... What? Oh, okay, I gotta get the right amount of coins to get in there. Got it. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Does feel a little awkward. Oh, and there's a time limit, of course. Ah! <laughs> I take it all back. It really, feels really awkward to do this. <laughs> wow, I'm really bad. And I get out of there. <laughs> wow, I really sucked at that. <laughs> feels like I'm in more control while I'm in control, but then I start messing it up and <laughs> it just... Slipped out of my grip. Alright, Act 3. Might be finishing this episode after this one. But, uh, yeah, I gotta say, so far it doesn't feel super bad or anything, just... Fairly faithful to the old, olden game, so basically what I expect from Sonic 4, but... I guess the big problem might be it's not what you expect of Sonic 4 in, like... Ah, oh, God, all my coins. What do you expect from a Sonic 4, you know, after so many years? Like, if this came out within, I don't know, a decade of, the, of 3 or Sonic Knuckles, then people might have been a bit more forgiving for lack of innovation, assuming that is the problem. Or maybe they're just really picky about the visual style, which, you know. I can understand, I'm just usually very forgiving about that stuff in the long run. So long as it doesn't look like really bad. And I don't think this looks really bad, it's just not as pleasing to me as pixel art would probably be an oh god damn it. How did I hit that fireball again? Even when the fireball misses, it does not miss because I make sure it doesn't. What? Did I hit something there? Huh. Come again. Uh, get me up there. Oh god. 
Truly, I am the greatest of Sonic players. Give me shoes. Oh, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm breaking the game with my shittiness. <laughs> Got a lot of the other good stuff. If you like the homing attacks, I guess you'll uh, like them being at it. But yeah, I, I never really played the 3D Sonic game. I, I think Generations is the first 3D Sonic game that I owned. And that's because of the whole idea of being being the nostalgic one, where we look back at the history of the games. Aside from that, I only really played Sonic Battle on the uh, Game Boy Advance, which I actually played recently. But that that doesn't really count as a Sonic game per se. It's such a spin-off-y one. Just never had much interest in the kind of 3D platforming stuff. And it probably is a product of when it came out. Uh, okay, having the jump makes the sh screen shake if I'm not touching anything, I guess. Not sure why it does that, but let's see if I can do a little bit better this time. Uh, bouncing off everything. Ugh. This just looks super trippy. It's kind of fucking with my eyes. <laughs> I think I'm going to try and get the uh, extra time here. Ah! And the coins are too good and greedy. There we go. Ah. Boing up, oh, there we go. Didn't remember the boing boingers. Yeah. Got up. Oh. Get in there! <laughs> God damn it, Sonic! Ah, why does that shake the screen? That's so weird. Definitely a lot more feels a lot more slow paced than the old and bonus games, and I'm still running out of time. I'm so darn slow. Oh god, getting Oh god! You fucking bouncing things! Let me get in there! Get get oh my Get it, get it, get it, get it, Yes! Breaking three seconds to spare. Never mind about it being slow. <laughs> just... The hurry is uh, all focused to the end. Ah, uh, that's probably ridiculous. First Chaos Emerald, yay! <laughs> Alright, I think this is a pretty good spot to uh, pause the game and... Ah, uh... oh, okay. Maybe do the screen select, I guess. All right, uh, this is a good place to pause for a while. Uh, this was Mikolov's Gaming, and take care till next time.